Next stop on the national road, Pocahontas. Founded in 1828 as Hickory Grove by Benjamin Johnson, who named it for the hickory trees that surrounded his log cabin. The town was a popular stagecoach stop. Then for a time, it was called Amity, after the town's largest hotel of the same name. In 1850, the town changed the name again to Pocahontas with an O. Finally, the O was changed to an A in 1855. Stories regarding the name's origins conflict. However, most believe the town was named after the famous Native American princess Pocahontas. The Native American theme is displayed in many places throughout the town. Coal mines operated here from 1906 through 1942 and employed as many as 500 people during its height of production. Country music star Gretchen Wilson has embraced Pocahontas as her hometown, and there's even been a park named in her honor. Gretchen Wilson Park has numerous ball diamonds, a playground, and even a small lake. Just north of town, you can enjoy a wine tasting experience like no other. The Copper Dock is a gathering place offering a full bar, a wine tasting room, deli, and live entertainment on the weekends. You can sip your favorite wine while seated on their dock overlooking an elegant small lake. Newbie's Steakhouse got its start in the 1920s as the Big Shoal Amusement Park, famous for its swimming pool and live entertainment. Though the amusement park is long abandoned, you can still see the faded remnants of the park buildings nearby. Take the time to explore the unique little town of Pocahontas as you travel along the historic National Road.